five of us went to Korea together from Halifax in their chummed around together and Casey was a real good friend. We grew up together, joined the army together and he was 18 when he got killed, got his head blown off and uh, that bothered me for years and years. I had nightmares. I would wake up yelling, screaming, Casey, get out of the bunker, get out of the bunker. And I got out first and he he, he was kind of a lazy guy, <laughs> he didn't really like to sleep. And uh, yeah, that stayed with me for years and years. Then I had this guilt. I wasn't a very religious man, but he used to say in the Bible, Thou shalt not kill. So when I came came home, and I was young, I was only 19, and it bothered me. I said, No, I shall not kill, but it doesn't say, that's all it says. The Lord said, I shall not kill on your commandment. Today. But I felt guilty because I knew a kill house a machine gunner. And then when we fired into the crowd, when we were firing 250 rounds per minute, every visit I had with Dr. Sarah, I, she had a, a way of getting you to express yourself. She made me so relaxed that I had to talk about it, and when I did talk about it, the things I seen, and what we did, I felt a little better, and I got a little better every time we had a. We used to look forward to it. My wife does too. To any type of trauma, it it's it's less about where you were and what you ex what the event was. It's more the person's experience of those events. So. Um, reactions to combat, um, reactions to seeing atrocities, reactions to um, witnessing or experiencing violence, um, that kind of thing. That affects people very deeply and across the board. Um, mm -hmm. So there, there's not a big difference in that sense. The human reaction to trauma is pretty consistent. And I was very fortunate to have a Second World War veteran to take me, uh, uh, Corporal uh, uh, Penrose, take me under his wing. And he told me not what to do and not to do. And the first thing he said, don't volunteer for anything. <laughs> and I keep that up today. <laughs>